not landing with the gravel. Pretty solid rock right there. Gets him back there. He gets him up to it. You don't typically see sleeping because he's up to it all that much. Uh oh. Hopefully, Loud doesn't decide to drift away from the ledge this time. And really the ledge this time. Oh, ladder combo. Not gonna finish it off though. Let's see. I still read the roll and just a bit too late with that fourth so. Okay, I'm not looking too easy for Vlad right now. The side beat onto the stage. That's what Sleepy Curve did not feel that. The side beat's gonna catch um, Sleepy Curve after that switch to Pyra. Up to the other disadvantage, not quite gonna pay off. 120 now after that down air. This game is pretty even now, though. It's a lot better for Vlad than it did the last time they played at the last. Smash then. Tries to run up up smash. Sleepy curve classic. Up there, not quite gonna do it. Now he's gonna catch that landing though. 132 now on Sleepy Curve, but only 120 still on Loud. Up smash finally gonna take that stock though. Loud now on the second stock. Full throw, yep, full throw. Tries to catch the um switch to ledge with the dash attack. Up tilt finally gonna take that stock off the platform. Down there somehow catches that jump as well. You miss spaces to grab. Up tilt, up smash, out of the field, not quite gonna do it. Up tilt is very safe. Especially if you get that later. Up tilt, not smash, not quite gonna work out. Which will be gonna catch that approach to Super Curve. Nice little Nair gonna cancel out that fireball and catch Super Curve's jump. Nice little bait out of the grab right there. Now I'm going to get him out of that little makeshift combo there. I'd be on the stage with the grab out there. Not sure if going to finish that off. I'm going to get that Mario Flowchart combo that I mentioned in that past video. Tries to get that one frame on that uh, forward smash. Not going to get it this time though. Still not going to do it again. Does the, does the smash hit for the uh, side piece, so it's going to be a bit too far to keep the shield. So we're finally going to take that stock. Sleepy Curve now at a two stock to one deficit right now. No back around the shield. Going to run up back there. Run up forward Oh, oh, I thought that was a bit too low. Up there, up smash, up smash, up smash. Run up, up smash, the usual. Tries to catch that uh, stock early, though, with that up and up with the uh, Down throw, forward there, gonna get 27% on Sleepy Curve. Switches to the Pyro pretty early. Super down there, not gonna get it. Playing with the forward tilt. Down there, not quite. 135 on Blau, 27 on Sleepy Curve right now. Tries to go for some kind of foot tool combo there. Get it, get it. 141 tries to lead some kind of air dodge or something. Okay, we're not gonna get the foot tool. Up smash. Sleepy Curve just not able to land these up smashes like he usually is. That's like his main way to take stock. Sends out the reflector a bit too late. I'm not gonna take Sleepy Curve yet. Yeah, that's sweet. Bob just holding on to his stock right now. Gets two frame with that. Back here, finally gonna take that stock off. Sleepy Curve at 75 though, Bob. Still starting out their last stock. Down there, up there, gonna put 19 on the Sleepy Curve. Side so B gonna put a whole lot of damage back on. Sleepy Curve at about 100% right now. A whole lot of stuff from Pyro will kill. Down throw, 14 more percent. Tries to do an empty landing uh, jab. Doesn't punish it, gets punished with the up tilt instead. Sleepy curve at a whole lot of percent right now. It's a technical turn. Yep. A whole lot of percent. Cloud kind of just swinging at nothing. Down air. Too far to combo off of though. A B. Ooh, tries to get some kind of read on that. Good DI away from Cloud. Nice spacing from Cloud not to get hit by that late hit of the dash attack. That's how they lost their stop a couple of times in the previous set. Wow, just trying to get some kind of good spacing with that full tail. Game one's gonna go wild. <laughs> I can feel the curve oh, yeah. from here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just happy that somebody's finally showing this dude. I know, right? It's the circle of, of life, man. Sick of it. Sick of it. I mean, really, you saw the, the key moment there mm -hmm. at the end. I, uh, obviously, I didn't see the beginning half. But yeah. 
you see Curb go for that down throw into the uh, the reverse yeah, beam, the, right? Yeah. Which you see all the time, and people are like, well, I'm at the edge of the stage, I'm going to DI in, and you get spiked. Yep. Cloud knows that move, he DIs he away, up, creates yeah. space, he's like, I can up be back, who gives a shit? Yeah. So if you mix up, just oh, smart yeah. play. <laughs> this name's fucking Money Man yeah, now. Seriously. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Fucking money, man. Cloud sticking with the Tyra Mithra going into game two. Fight money, man. What is he, night money? All he does is money match, motherfuckers. Where are we going now? Field of... Or Fountain of Dreams. Field uh, of Denim. Field of Denim. F-O-D. That's what he's saying for. Well, I'm just kind of going to run up and not do anything right he's there. He's punching the jaw a few times. Yep. He just kind of ran up and tried to uh, do something, but nothing came out. Let's drop. Ooh, getting a little bit of a combo here. Oh, I'm not gonna get that last up air though to extend the combo. Oh, I think that's the up. It's too low. You're the death. Is that, is that cause an SD? I, I think so, yeah. Okay, there goes on your counter. You, they still have the double jump. They were just, yeah. That's 100% your fault. Anyway. Zero <laughs> death is huge though. We saw one early on today, and there's another one now. Me, it was against you, I wasn't gonna mention that. Ooh, tries to read some kind of tech in place or something. Doesn't get the forward smash though. There, that move is so good and so underrated, this pirate Nair. It's an out of shield option and it kills mad early, like around 120%. Wow, do not. Alright. Good. <laughs> I'm looking for some kind of uh, stock finisher right here. Looking for some puppies, looking for some down there confirms. Not quite gonna get anything just yet. There it is. Oh, nice. just barely. Nice with that up beat. Gets the star kill yep. out of it. Just weaves over that dash attack and just lands right on top of him. Got two stocks each. Ooh, up air chain. Not gonna take it just yet. Common Dreams does have a pretty high ceiling compared to other Triclats. Run up up smash, Slippy Curve Classic as usual. Nice read on that, Tekken Place, and that's a death from Blau. Yeah, I'll say that DI put him in a rough spot on that low trajectory. It's always rough when you end up in that spot where you're looking for a down tilt yourself yeah. and you get hit by that down smash and just to fly in at low angles. <laughs> Ignore the fact that it's frame five. It's just completely a bad point. Yeah. That smash goes. Oh, goes. really? Cloud nice. going for a whole lot of these footstool combos, but hasn't been able to land on the Hasn't even the footstool at all. Ooh. I think Kurt still has their double yeah, jump. Yeah, he's definitely yep. fine to get back from that one. He loves keeping their double jump. Wow, it's in that whole lot of percent right now. 84, 110 on Sleepy Curve though. It's such a good protection if you're recovering to that side special. Harry's the last hit of that neutral group, but still not able to get a punch off of it. Wow, kind of throwing out full soaps. Back air. We're just looking for fireballs. He doesn't want to get too aggressive off stage. Oh, air dodge up, that's going to do it. Yo, brings it to 1-1. One, one. One, one. Gentlemen's one game. Gentlemen's one game? Is that what you're going with? It is yes. best of five, yeah. It's winner final. Yeah. Gentlemen's, Gentlemen's one game. game. <laughs> Doesn't even make sense. That's genius. It Gen is genius. You See, I see thought of three No, you could have gone with Gentlemen's best of three, though. No, you could have gentlemen's best of one. Play, but it's not a gentleman's best of one where we're at. They would each have to win another game for it to be a gentleman's best of one. Gentlemen's best of one. Just gentlemen's as a best of one right away. Yeah. You're like, alright, we're, we're playing uh, Rainbow Cruise Hazards on one game. Let's go. Three, two, Both one, random. <laughs> alright, loud. Both sticking it out. Just sticking with the same characters. I'm going to talk to time soon. Fully charge that has an extra hit if fully charge it. Don't think Super Curve will remember that. <laughs> he will now. <laughs> oh. Actually, probably like, wait, what the fuck? I thought it was only some drugs. Back to my 
Down tilt, not gonna get anything off of it. Just keep it too low. So, like, you're gonna do down tilt where you can combo in the field. Ooh, fully charged neutral. We can send the wrong way, though. Really nice there. It's a whole lot of damage on Sleepy Curve right now. All they need is one. Ooh, that was almost it. I was gonna say just one Mario combo, just one down throw should probably do it. Uh oh. Nice wait. Oh, that was almost perfect timing. Hard punish on the recovery there. Cloud almost gets yeah. the Trying to get that one frame just again. Back there, not quite. Sleepy Curve has brought this back pretty much entirely. Like, Cloud was only at about like 20 something. <laughs> Ooh, reads the roll in with that up smash. Like, what are you gonna play? Like, Samus? You should play on that. That's what I said. Slinky Grip's still at three stocks. Wow, 29% on their second. That was the origin of it all. Yeah. Short hop side B, interesting option, but it's gonna put some good damage on. Ooh, reach the goal! Nice turnaround from Blau, that's gonna take that stock off the Sleepy Curve. Not gonna get that upper combo though. Lower tilt, reach for the second place. Four shadows, they're not four shadows. Four sights out of that combo though, thank god. Sleepy Curve doing a good job of reading those rolls right now. Not gonna get that forward smash. Ooh, I think they still have their double jump. I mean, it doesn't matter, you're gonna recover with side B. 128 on Blob right now. 52 only on Sleepy Curve. Both on second stock though. Okay, run up grab. Blob gonna get grabbed. Down B through that fireball. Yep, that's pretty much a free edge guard for Sleepy Curve right there. Last stock for Blob. Still got at least one more game though, so Blob doesn't have to worry too much. They're gonna put some damage on some, some nice knocks back up. Ooh, gets that side B reflect. Not gonna have enough knockback to send into the uh, forward player though. Sleepy Curve out for blood right now. Just kind of looking for anything to finish the stock. Tries to reflect that. Oh, that, I think that's the up. Sleepy Curve playing a bit too long on that. Yep, I think so. I'm not totally sure. I don't know if that's it. That might just be a free edge guard for, yep, there it is. Down smash, gonna take game three for Sleepy Curve. Now that world is over, you just gotta play Valorant until Champions Well, you've got the arcane mini battle pass right now for Southern Steam games. I'm not satisfied with going on too. I want money coming. back somewhere. It's uh, 10 levels and there's 5 things and then 50 RP or whatever. Well, when a new RP, character so. comes out, it's not this Tuesday, but the next one. Yeah. I see, thought, do you have any cash? Yeah. Mario, I want a money match somewhere. I'm not happy that I'm going to do that. You want a money match curve? His name's no, Money Match. Not curve. I money matched him at IPA a couple weeks ago for $1. <laughs> <laughs> it's the worst dollar you've ever spent. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Well, I think we can get it out of that combo. Going back to Hollow Bastion for this game 4. We're tilting the dash attack. What? Pyramithra is kind of cool in a way because you can kind of just like do whatever combo you want. Kind of like Diddy Kong. Create your own combo. Yeah. Just do whatever you want. Pretty much. It doesn't do too much damage, so it's not bad. But... Pyramithra cannot latch on in face. Yeah. That's exclusive Diddy Kong stuff. Yeah. Still has the double jump, but surprise. I thought they did Grib looking for a whole lot of up stuff. It's a whole lot of sword in the chest. Oh. Doesn't get that upward hit though. Not able to suck him into a lightning buster. Yeah, it was pretty close, the timing there. Well avoided by Sleepy Curve. Switching over to the Pyro. Up he's not going to do a down smash. I think they can still recover from that. Yep. Ooh. Perfect timing. Anti-air, yep. 
perfect spacing. Wow, trying to get in a little too aggressive from above. Planks with a dash? I'm gonna be careful looking for a parry as to avoid a um, shield break right there. Switching back to the shield break for some reason. Oh, he reads the air dodge out but just whiffs on that drag. Whoa. Nope, not gonna get two frame this time. Yeah, I'm not quite gonna do it just yet. Remember that it has that extra hit though. Yeah, that's that time he's like, hold on a moment. It's sniped with that, um, I don't know what it's called. I know the multi-hit is called Chroma Dust. I gave up on trying to know all the ability names so long ago. Ooh, dash attack gonna... There it is again again! The exact same thing happens last Smash then. Gets caught with that dash attack over and over again. Ooh, nice catch with Sneaky Turd dropping that shield a bit too fast. You know, I gotta say, it's interesting. You should not really use that, the charge B there, at all in the previous Smash Gens, and that's something just completely added to his Yeah, seriously. And he's using it, he's using it very lot. well. You know, Ooh, you, can, you can maybe even argue it's, it's too much, but like, he's finding where it's useful, and it seems like he's working into his repertoire really well. Yeah, it's like that, and just land with that multi hit. And it's not like uh, Nair, where it's just like has the landing hitbox and then just kind of punish them. It's just like four continuous hits that don't stop after you land. No punish there on the high recovery for some reason. I think he wanted to come in there and do something missing the foot. Yeah, I guess so. That's happened twice now. Because he did dash up as if he was going for something and then he just stopped. Like, he's still just getting mixed up with these landing lightning busters. Okay. Oh, oh nice the again. snipe! Well, Kurt thought another snipe was coming, that came. Yeah. <laughs> Not get up attack. Booty, booty, booty. I'm surprised. I'm surprised Blau doesn't be going for any like defense or anything with uh, down throw. Yeah. Yeah. If, if I remember, I had a good. Uh, I think down throw. Yeah, I think down throws their kill throw, but it only kills. It, it's throw in the combo. It kills at like one. Eight. It's pretty bad. Well, for a does the throw kill on some? Is it a throw into like up air? No, it's down throw. It's, like, it just kills itself. Yeah. Yeah. It's still 180s. Absurd. That's not a useful thing. Yeah. Ooh, gets that read on the overextension. In a forward bro. I don't think Pyro falls out of it. No, it's your blast. There Doesn't we go. matter. Finds the up smash. Finally, not gonna fall out of the up smash on the platform. That happens to Ronaldo forever ago. I was gonna say 114 is the stock starts though. Yeah. Rough spot to be. Should be curved with the 3-1 after Blau takes 3-1.